everyone, it is me, Angela, your friendly neighborhood hot mess. Oh yeah, you don't know my new intro. That's my new intro. He doesn't watch my videos. Yep, you don't want me. Yeah, I don't let him. <laughs> what are we doing? <laughs> oh yeah, you gotta introduce yourself. If you didn't know, this is... Steve. We are going to go over our top three superhero films of 2018. We're only um, doing three this time because that top five each for the games was a bit much. Yeah. I'm going to move this along. Do you want to start, Angela, with uh, your top three? Number three. Um, my most anticipated number three superhero film coming out in 2018 is... Larry, do not judge me. This counts. I don't care what you have to say about this. It counts. And, um... That's The Incredibles too. When he, when I first told him I'm putting it on there, he's like, that doesn't count. They're superheroes. It is a movie. And it comes out June 15th, and I'm so excited. Okay, guys. My number three is probably a movie that we're probably having you scratching your heads of why it's on my list. It's a franchise that has some really good movies and some pretty bad ones. And the previous one, Apocalypse, ended up being a very mediocre film. But my number three is X-Men X Men Dark Phoenix. Um, sad that Hugh Jackman can't be in it. So we'll see how it goes. Hopefully there's going to be plenty of Magneto because he's obviously one of the best aspects of the franchise. So I'm excited for it and I'm hoping it's a good movie. Oh wait, also it comes out. November 2nd. Our number two is the same. So you want to say it at the same time? Yeah. Okay, ready? One, two, three. Deadpool. Deadpool. One, two, three. Deadpool, Deadpool two. two. One more Deadpool. time. Say it like you mean it. One, two, two three. Deadpool, Deadpool three. three. Oh. It comes out June 1st. Okay. Uh, number one. Do you want to say your number one and then I can go say no, my number one? No, you say your number one first, which for the record, his number one would have been on my list, but since he already said it, I decided to just pick something else. Um, it wouldn't have been my number one per se, because my number one is my number one, but it definitely has made my most anticipated list, but go ahead. My number one is a film that Mar uh, the Marvel Studios have been working towards for a long time, this is a film, a story that's been. It's everything's yeah, been leading, leading up, up to, to this, this moment with the Infinity Stones and Thanos, and obviously what I'm talking about is uh, Avengers: Infinity War. And I, I'm am, so excited. Guardians are gonna be in it. Yes, I. They're my fave. I'm a. I love me some Cap, and mm -hmm. I hope they do him some justice. Yeah, because he's not Cap anymore. Yeah, <laughs> it's all supporting the tough guy. Have you seen photos? He's got a nice, thick beard. Nice old manly man now. He's not that... He's not that suave kid anymore like he used to be. Okay. I'm pretty sure he was a manly man when he held onto a building and a helicopter. He's not so clean cut anymore, though. Okay, not clean cut, I get it. He's all rugged now. Now! He's seen some things in life. Uh, Infinity War comes out May 4th, two days after my birthday. So we're going to be going to see it for his birthday. Yes. The moment everyone has been waiting for, because no one cares about you, is my number one. And my number one is Black Panther. And it comes out February 16th. And I'm dragging you to see it. We are going to be so broke this year. Because between this and all the book adaptations, we're going to be so broke. The only one will have movie pass. Oh yeah, this is true. Guys, we're getting movie pass. Cause oh, well, we're not getting paid to say this. No. Oh, yeah, no. <laughs> they know I get I've got like 200 and something yeah. subscribers. So, we're not promoting Hash shit. Hashtag not sponsored. Disney Marvel did not sponsor this video. Hashtag, hashtag. Let us know if you would like us to make videos on these. And after we watch them, do we say if they did us justice? Did they justify being on our top list or not? Yeah, we will. That would be fun. A follow up. Um. I, I do also want to see New Mutants. Yeah. Uh, I want to see the animated uh, Miles um, Spider-Man. Gosh, I can't talk. <laughs> I want to see I, that. I'm feeling iffy on the Venom film just because, it's, as far as I understand, it's not set in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. So I'm because like, it's by uh, Sony, just like the old Spider-Mans. I yeah. wish they would have, you know. But, however, it 
However, um, we had no DC movies on here. <laughs> Well, Aquaman, Aquaman comes out later this year. Maybe that'll be decent. We'll, we'll see. We'll go we'll, watch it. But we'll see. Um, the yes, only... DC is not our fave. However, that Wonder Woman movie, though. The I'm Wonder going Man... to be doing a video just on that Wonder Woman movie because that impressed me so much. I have been putting it off and putting it off because every DC movie I watch is and so disappointing. They, and then they followed it up with, with the Justice, Justice League. League. It was such a disappointing Oh, yeah. eh, If I would have watched Justice League after I watched Wonder Woman, I would have been so pissed. I saw it first, though. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, that's all we have. And thank you guys for watching. What are your most anticipated movies? Our superhero movies of 2018. And we'll see you next time. See you later. Bye. Bye, guys. Nice, thick beard.